Hey Blazer Nation, Jordan here from the VSU Red Hots, and I've got the latest scoop on everything happening this week in Blazer Athletics. We've got golf, soccer, volleyball, basketball, and football updates all coming your way right now on the Hot Minute. Fall is in the air and basketball is on the horizon. Both the men's and women's basketball team started their official preseason schedule this week. So be sure to keep an eye out on this week for photo galleries and interviews on our Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram feeds. The Blazer golf team returned to action down in Tampa, Florida at the beginning of the week and placed ninth out of 14 teams at Copperhead Championship. Junior Matt Anderson was VSU's top player, shooting just three over par during three rounds of action. Out of 74 participants, Matt finished the tournament tied for 12th overall. Blazer Volleyball is rolling along after a tough weekend at the Sunshine State Golf South Crossover Tournament and a narrow loss to West Florida on Tuesday night. Tristan Sells and Chloe Shubalu were the bright spots last night with season highs in the kill column. And senior Sydney Chick added 24 digs. VSU will look to break a four-game skid this weekend with a Friday match at 7 p.m. against West Alabama and a Saturday showdown at 1 p.m. against Mississippi College. Both matches will take place at the complex. The soccer program is on the verge of locking up a spot in the playoffs after a 6-0 win over Auburn Montgomery and a tie with powerhouse North Alabama last weekend at the VSU Soccer Complex. Suvi Savalainen posted a hat trick in last Wednesday's game, and freshman Haley Patterson scored twice during the week. One more win will clinch the postseason berth for the Blazers, but the team will have to get that win on the road this weekend during a pair of matches against Union and Christian Brothers in Tennessee. The Blazer football team demolished the Choctaws of Mississippi College last Saturday with a 55-3 conference victory. Quarterback Rogan Wells led the way on offense with one rushing touchdown and three touchdown passes, while Malik Slater carried the Black Swarm with nine tackles. Orasta State will try and hold momentum this Saturday in a 3 p.m. Eastern matchup against Delta State in Cleveland, Mississippi. As always, you can find coverage of all of our events, including this weekend's GSC Cross Country Championship, using the links available at vstateblazers.com. Thanks for watching. We'll be back for more next week, right here on Blazer Nation's Weekly Hot Minute.